That being said, though, I, d <laughs> I, I do want to point out, though, Vitz being a stock up on Pekko. Oh, real excited. good in, I'm assuming, game one. Uh, no, game two, actually. Game two, interesting. Okay. All right, but anyway, we're going to be moving on to game one of Mega versus Infernape. So right now, Infernape looking to make quick work of Mega's first stock. 94% unanswered from Mega. Ooh, wow. almost getting the clip there with the up smash, not quite finding it. And instead, now finally, Mega is able to put some work in. All right, looking like, ooh. I was to say it's going to be the I come back, but nope. Uh, Mega doing a good job of just running away, being patient with that banana, Ooh. using that monkey flip to get in. Pressured. The Mega. wing bounce movement. Wow. Always okay. so sick. I love seeing that from Mega. It's unfortunate that he's using the Nair just too much, and Infernape is just doing a great job of calling it out. Ooh. Oh, boy. Here we go. Banana. Oh, not quite able to get the, uh, get the confirm off of the banana with the neutral air. That would have been huge damage, but instead, Mega is getting the chance to get right back into the driver's seat. Getting there to up air. That's always a good combo, but not going to kill just yet. Dash attack very close. I'm surprised that we haven't seen a single neutral special this entire game. Out of Mega? Yeah. I mean, this entire bracket. Eh, it's good for Guardian. People forget about it. Uh, I mean, Mega is definitely a bit more of a patient player and able to find just the right moment, just like that F-Tilt right there. Ooh, all right. Oh, nice E drop there. Unfortunately, not able to make anything out of it. Yeah, Infernape not phased by the item play from Mega right there. Instead, getting a banana conversion of its own. Not quite finding the kill, though. And yeah, this is definitely where we're starting to see the patience of Mega coming out. But uh, getting caught Ooh. on the roll in, Infernape was ready for it at that time, and only 21% on the second stock. Infernape is looking to lap Mega in percentage. Unfortunate. All right. Looks like Mega likes playing very patiently here, not wanting to accumulate Ooh. any more power. Love the empty movement by Mega right now, keeping Infernape at bay and in this corner as well, making sure that Infernape the is not peanuts. able to use this platform. Ooh, yeah, the you peanut movement! Oh, the banana in hand. Uh-oh. Here we go. It's going in. No fear. Finding the dash attack to set up some potential ledge trapping. Great getup attack to avoid the meaty dash attack from Infernape. It's a great use of the peanut gun there. Just to keep Mega on their toes. Ooh, Ooh. Getting caught by the banana, but unfortunately Infernape not able to find the down air, and instead Mega is able to bring us to even stocks. All right, 62%. This is still very doable. Ooh, all right, the, uh, the Aether coming out. That's a clean 21%. So, just so much damage. Oh, no. Okay. Ooh. I think Infernape was trying to throw the banana there, not realizing that it was in Mega's hands. <laughs> Obviously, you get so used to having it in your hand, you're like, this is just a part of me now. Oh, oh no, Mega kept the jump, so he's oh. able to quick draw back to ledge. No way, no way, okay. Yeah, now he's just gonna be drifting right back to ledge. We're Honestly. starting to see the patient play work out for Mega. That banana setup was so clean. Okay, all right, managed to catch him, pop him in the air. And Fernape really just needs a down tilt conversion. But Mega, just one hit. Just one hit. Oh, that empty movement. I thought that was a jump in down oh. tilt. A smash. Everyone in the world thought the that was a jump in down tilt. Okay, <gasps> easy. And Fernape, just looking for one oh. thing to convert. Okay, no chase, no chase. <laughs> Slipped on the banana peel on the oh. way in. But there's that chase. No! Okay, Mega, forcing to uh, cover the options here on the ledge. And Mega playing things patiently, not jumping in to the banana. So just waiting patiently for the peanut to hit them. The great spacing by Mega around that forward air. The banana movement. No, uh oh, no. that was almost it. He air dodged into it. So lucky he didn't get hit. Aether. No, no, that would be too no. risky. No way. Uh, that hasn't worked. Please <laughs> do something. <laughs> right, I'm begging to you. Oh. Nope. That's a re-grab, re but Infernape not able to really do anything about it. Instead, letting oh the banana put the pressure on. He just wanted one hit, and that's it. That's going to be doing it. 
both play both players taking a deep breath. Infernape looking a little purple, but I think he was holding his breath for so long. Mega taking a moment to compose himself. I, I hope Mega's Catch okay. Breath. I'm concerned about the bandage. <laughs> Who, who hurt you? Who hurt you? Who, who, hurt who you, do we need to beat up? <laughs> Infernape. Infernape hurt him. Oh, no. You know he's got that. Uh, he's got that damage scaling on. You know, the, the more damage Real he takes in rage. the game. <laughs> oh wow! Meeting in the middle, shaking hands. Wait a minute. Good game. Good game. Gra Best Grab of tech luck. Puts on one percent of damage. I've never seen that before. Because <laughs> you don't see grab techs very often in this game. <gasps> oh! No okay, way okay. Infernape lived that. Honestly, I would have just given it up. Like, all right, man, you got me. Godlike DI. <laughs> GG, next stock. <laughs> you deserve it. I wanted to instant replay that. <laughs> True. You know, you can instant replay it, and you can just deny us, like, you know, the, the serotonin. Yeah, I just cut out early to imply <laughs> that the death yes. happened. Just Smash like, clips I hate. A compilation. <laughs> <laughs> Most unsatisfying clips. <laughs> Did he die? It's just, it, it, it's just a... Uh, <laughs> Not will it kill, we'll, did we'll, he die? We'll yeah. leave that up to you, viewers. It's the inception little... of Smash. <laughs> it's up for interpretation. <laughs> it's metaphorical. Well, but Infernape not phased by that clip at all, and instead now getting the percent lead and putting Mega off stage, the perfect banana placement as well. Oh my gosh, this nothing metaphorical about that stock on, though. Right. I'm answering right back into the dash attack. Yeah, Mega not wasting any time getting back to even stocks. Whoa. Ooh, the conversions. Oh, Good I thought job that was another grab. Advantage. No grabs needed. Not after that grab attack. Ooh, and I love the spacing by Mega right there. Spacing right outside the monkey flip. Okay. Uh-oh, platform conversions. <laughs> this is where Ike is scary. Wow, Mega really looked Ooh. like MK Leo over here. The early days. Infernape just not able to find find his footing. Only 12% on Mega's second stock, while Infernape's second is just deleted, evaporated. All right, Mega can take it just a little easy here. And play patiently. Not too aggressive. Aggressive seems to be working, though. Yeah, I Ignore really... Ignore the commentator. <laughs> I really appreciate the way that Mega has been... Uh, or how he uh, turned the turned the patience back up after getting that uh, that first clip. Right. Because you know you get you get that F smash read. Your endorphins are running high. You just want to kill the Diddy Kong. And Mega took a lot of percentage for that. Oh, there we go. Aww. Aww. Sm another smash clip oh. by Hayes. All right. I don't know what that eruption was hitting. All right, but yep, that just a clean tilt, F tilt. What a dominant performance there! Absolutely, that was that was that was absolutely Mega's game to win. Moving on to game three. Hmm. Where do you think they'd want to go? Perhaps town and city. No, Kalos is banned. Kalos and FD being uh, Mega's bands of choice, and yeah, we are going to be seeing the town and city pick. Called it. Definitely, definitely a great uh, Diddy stage. And we've been seeing, um, we've of course been seeing Mega Kill off the uh, the top a lot. So of course the uh, like higher ceiling of Town and City gonna be helping with that. Lots of room to move to, lots of room to move around. Three, two, one. Oh, Mega, <laughs> Mega's excited. Mega he likes the song. He's like, hell yeah. All right, no KK, but we got the jams on. This is KK Bubblegum, I believe. I think so my favorites. There, there's not a lot of there's not a lot of Animal Crossing bangers, I'm not gonna lie. Hey. Hey. There, there's a couple good ones. This one's pretty good. Alright. Right. right now Infernape setting up the pressure, getting some good percentage on Mega so far. 82%. And definitely the like changing nature of uh, town and city gonna be doing good for Infernape uh, to kind of break up Mega's rhythm, especially the way that Mega's just been playing so patiently. He's going to have to adapt on the fly a lot more on Town and City. Exactly. 
Unfortunately, can't rely on those. Oh! Just barely Infernape had spaced that to be able to hit, like, the tip of the knuckle. Marvelous. Okay, I'm liking these monkey flips to get in. He's been hitting most of them. Oop. Oh, boy. All right. Peanuts for spacing. All right, great. Uh, spot dodge there to get the grab and catching Infernape with the dash attack on the way down. Not enough. What are we going to see? Okay, I can see oh. the forward tilt, but the monkey flip just too fast. Yeah, unfortunately, Mega tried to react to the monkey flip, but getting another dash attack to even up the stocks. Gotta watch that banana on the on the way down. That could have been a little bit scary if Infernape had landed that. It seems to be that banana's pretty easy to punish if you can call that out. As he's throwing it, that dash attack can come out fast enough. Uh-oh. Look, high ceilings, but an up air from Ike is still pretty scary. That being said, though, only 20% on Infernape so far. Mega not really able to find any any meaningful hits. Kind of raising the roof there with the up tilts, just getting caught for his troubles. Come on, Mega, 20%. Those are rookie numbers. Get those numbers up. Ooh. Even with the banana in hand, Infernape still weaving around and a down tilt into up smash. Not going to be finding it just yet on Town and City. Oh, unfortunately missing the edge barely. That's a re-grab, though. That forward tilt barely missing. Ooh, all right, just getting barely scooped by that Aether. Finally putting some uh, damage on the board for Mega. Whoa. I, that was That's a gonna kill. very scary position for Infernape, but able to make it back into center stage, get the monkey flip throw, and get the get that rage off of the Ike. Unfortunately, Mega, impossible tournament stock. Infernape just needs one more to keep going. All right, great neutral air to catch the monkey flip in. And as well, once again, catching Infernape uh, air dodging on the way down. Mega bringing us to last stock of game three. All Fresh right. stocks on both sides. Do you think we're going to see Diddy versus Diddy or Ike versus Diddy again? Either either Mega has to go through the Diddy gauntlet or we're going to be seeing a loser's semis, uh, a loser's semis Diddy ditto. Oh, baby. Honestly, both options sound pretty hyped to me. So tune in right here. At okay. Zeno 291. You're keeping the platform pressure as Infernape at the ledge once again. Oh. I think uh, still doesn't have the jump. Not able to find the two frame with the down tilt, unfortunately, for Mega. It's oh, good no. pressure, but none of them hit it. Oh, that banana has been hitting every time, though. Oh, oh the call out enough. on the empty movement by Infernape. Such good adaptation to call out the empty jump. Okay. Really last hit for both players here. 104 and 109 respectively. Uh -oh. Hey, nothing happening. Forward tilt. Ooh. <laughs> Close though. Hey, no, 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 no. Yep, he's going to be drifting right back onto that ledge. But no, that's not going to be an option anymore with this uh, current town and city layout. Because, of course, the uh, those platforms are going to be <laughs> catching him as well. Infernape trying to catch with the down tilt. If you're happy and you know, clap your hands. Ooh, oh no, that's, that's a gonna re -grab. be a regrab. Easy. Me yeah, that forward tilt. No, it's still Ooh. alive. Whoa, Infernape was breathing oh. easy. Okay, now he can breathe. <laughs> I think Mega jumped after landing to ensure that he wasn't tripped by the banana. Yeah. But unfortunately, just pressed too many buttons and Infernape was still able to get the confirm. Yeah, as we can see, that comes back. No, he didn't jump. Instead, just going over the banana. But uh, yeah, Infernape calling it out and be like, oh yeah, perfect. Oh no, did he get hit? Yeah, he does oh, jump. He, did. he tries oh. to take he takes the aerial banana hit, but Oh no! Yeah, it still just what caught slide. landing lag. Ah uh, <laughs> even Mega's like, oh. Yeah, so unfortunately a very hard fought battle from Mega, but Infernape is gonna be taking that 2-1 into loser semis, and we are gonna be seeing a Diddy Ditto.